Hi everyone, it's been a while since I last did a video, but um, I thought I'd come on and just show you how I make a really easy tincture. Tinctures are probably some of the easiest things I make with herbs and plants and it's so easy and you get so much from making a tincture. So you, when it comes to making herbal things, you can make teas and infusions or you can make decoctions or you can make tinctures and they're all very similar. And um, the main difference between them is that decoctions and infusions use um, hot water and tinctures use alcohol. So to make an infusion, you would just simply steep the plant matter in, in water, in boiling water. To make a decoction, you boil the plant matter in the water and they're really good for... Um, you know really woody plants or to extract some of the qualities that are not water soluble you'd make a tincture so that's what we're going to do today um, I'm going to be making the fly garlic tincture and um, it's just really important to say before we start that fly garlic is toxic and um, but what I'm going to do with the tincture is I'll probably just take a little bit at a time and um, you can use that for um, helping meditation, trance work, journeying, that kind of thing. So you've got in here, oh, <laughs> I'll pick that up. But in this tub, I've just got some um, dried fly garlic. It's just one mushroom, just dried, um, and it reduces right down. So I'm going to make a fairly strong tincture, but um, I do encourage people, if they are new to it, to start small. And then you can always build it up as you go. So I'm just going to pop all of the mushroom into a little tub. And then I'm going to use a good quality rum. You can use any spirit you like. Um, it's just that I've usually got rum in the house. Um, vodka's good, brandy, anything you want. Um, you really want to make sure it's got a high alcohol content. Um, that's... That's really the important thing. And it's just simply a case of topping that up with the alcohol. And then I'll pop the lid on there, wherever I put that. It'll be far away. But I'm gonna pop the lid on there and then just leave that for, you only want to leave it for at least a week, but longer if you can, um, anywhere up to around four weeks. And then just strain it into a clean bottle or jar and you can just take um a little bit to help with journeying and flight work and all of that kind of thing so there you go really easy tincture like i said they're probably the one of the easiest things i make um and you can do tinctures with any herbal product you like it doesn't have to be um it doesn't have to be like psychoactive um, common herbs it's a good way of preserving them and really getting the medic medicinal um, qualities from the plant so there you have it simple